Hello, guys. This is me, MP2. Here and we are here with a brand new Roy McIlroy PGA Go Tour EA Golf Sports. In association by with the EA PGA Sports. Tour, oh. proudly presents the season-long race for the FedEx Cup. Today, it's live third-round coverage of the BioWare Classic. So we are down by so one stroke, on or one birdie, whatever you want to call it. Some more funky gear for Looks like it's heading for the bunker. Yeah. Lucky Play devil. It. That was going in the bunker all the way. Birdie putt coming up. Had par on this hole yesterday. I ain't getting par on this hole. So. Pretty much yeah. doing everything right this week. Oh, and 11 he bumped under up for the again. Tournament. Stinson good bumped up. Good look down at the fifth hole here at the Wetlands. Par five, and it's a good one. 635 yards. And the magic word of golf. Four. Frank, it's a nice walk to make down the fairway when you can see your golf ball right there in the middle. Rich, there's an old saying, fairway first. And there's another example. Hit it in the fairway, and the game becomes very straightforward. Just a beautiful tee shot. He makes a great pass at the golf ball. It's powerful, but it's rhythmic at the same time. So, that's how... Frank, this is a position up. where a player is absolutely licking his chops here. Good chance to make a birdie. Yeah, this is when this game just looks like fun. Oh. Bunkers don't seem to be in play. The oh. only thing you're really looking at right now is Beautiful. just the flag. Terrific golf Beautiful. shot. Beautiful. Now, that Stetson court, don't, an easy birdie. Frank, this would be a nice way to get a birdie the on the hole that he's on, and, and then we are tied. Quickly go in the right direction if he makes this. Moves into and, the lead. Oh, he dropped birdie. one. Oh, you sniff another one coming along, too. On the Onto third the round, sixth here at the wetlands. One. And Frank, how does that water factor into the way you play this hole? It bisects this fairway beautifully, Rich. Uh, 233 yards to the run out on the you first section like, of the fairway. You're risking it. That might be worth considering for the short hitters. You gotta hitters. risk things to win flash things. across the narrowest part of those wetlands. 276 yards. And of course, the more horsepower you got, actually the easier this tee shot becomes. I say it's unplayable. Cause it's kind of unplayable. Kind of. Frank, over the course of the last 15 years or so, there have been a number of initiatives within the game of golf just to try to grow the sport. Yeah, we've seen the PGA Junior League, which is a series of competitions, obviously, for juniors to play. But the first tee really is worldwide now, just to try and introduce um, players from all over the world into the game of golf. They're introduced with club professionals. They learn skills that are essential, really, to play the game of golf. But uh, in 2014, there was a real step, I think, in the right direction. To, to showcase the junior talent around the world with the drive, chip, and putt. We well, actually get a chance to, to play the drive, chip, and putt final just, at Augusta National, the home of the Masters. Imagine young kids, boys and girls, uh, 8 years old, 11 years old, being able to go home oh and tell their gosh. friends, tell their families, hey, I have something in common with Jack Nicklaus, with Arnold Palmer, oh with my Phil gosh. Nicholson, with Tiger Woods. This I've is so freaking stupid. Augusta National Golf Club. So Here's another scoring stupid. opportunity, Frank, a par five. The seventh is just a shade under 600 yards. And it bends gently to Somehow the Somehow we're still in the lead. Get home and nothing really to be worrying about with that second shot if you can reach. Man, the wetlands it won't are well let me to move the, right the ball. This hole, um, for the second shot. But uh, if you want to play to the three shotter, then that's a very safe so conservative So he gets really a great tee off. 
The crowd is going wild. They don't even shush when he puts, when he swings, and another good hit. And they also start cheering after that one. Paying attention like a little kid at school, Frank. That baby's sitting up. Sitting up. It's got the best view as well. You don't even need binoculars so from where that ball is. So he's gonna use a 58 degree wedge. And that, that one looks right good. On and side. it is good. What a display of shot making this has been, Frank. Oh, that incredible approach shot there. The easiest of birdies coming up. And doing the robot. The birdies are hard to come by in this situation. So we're tied at 13, so tight. I think Keeps Stinson just got the a thick of it. Eight just got at the wetlands, eagle. Par three, 203 yards. You like this hole, Frank? I do, actually, but you have to have a little look at your yardage book because that uh, front bunker will make this hole look a little shorter uh, to the eye than actually what it plays. Green gets a little narrow as it gets deeper, but um, flat. And he's going to be uh, a long way from the hole easy. after that three hit. Here. Not too bad. Now this for birdie came away with par in the previous round. Uh, oh, and he gets a long putt. Oh my wow, goodness! Wow, I can't believe he found the cup on that one. So he is in the lead at the Bioware Classic for the Frank, third round. Frank, looking at this par five ninth hole, it's 621 and yards. I need this to make birdie here. What's the, the best way to go about it? The last well, if you're a long the hitter, front. then there's a chance you can reach this par five and two, Rich. But really, the best way to make birdie here, good tee shot, and then contemplate the layup in between the first two bunkers is a nice section and of front. fairway. And it's not going to leave you much in for that third shot to a green that's very receptive. So, so it's really another par five. Can be made the hard way. Wedge and a putt. And another good hit. And he is. Frank, really good chance. 109 yards to make away a from the Really, hole. the only thing he's looking at right now is the flag. Uh, this is a green light special. And that is a. That looks good. Oh, well, that is wow. An exceptional shot on the green. And he is in on the green. For a yeah, it's a formality now. And he's swinging for the fences. On the show, this tournament moves to 15 under par. There you have it. Round three is finished, and it was a good one, Frank. Yeah, after three rounds in, uh, so you really he is could up start to see. By could take three birdies against Henrik Stenson. Great play, though, up until and this he'll point. Knock uh, some round more four, should it be an absolute thriller? And, well, you know what goes on after we finish each round? We, you know, you guys might not like how we do it, but, you know. So if you guys like the video, like it. If you guys want to like the, what we do with this channel, subscribe. If you have some more like names of what we should do, like names for a golfer, name for a baseball player. If you want to see Man 15, wide receiver, tight end, quarterback, running back, it don't matter. And so, you know, the... Thank you guys for watching. See you guys later. Bye.